Now when you use an electronic scale, they work pretty good, but they can get a little screwy once in a while. I was using this bullet right here for a check weight. I went through a bunch of full metal jacket bullets, and I found one that weighed exactly 55 grains. So I was using that for a check weight for quite a while, and uh, I was just wondering if I could make a check weight that was more about what I was loading, so it'd be a little bit closer. Just give me a a little bit more accuracy maybe so I bought some of this aluminum stock right here of course I had no idea how much it would weigh I wanted to get a check weight that was 45.9 grains so I had no idea what length that would be so I had to have a starting point so my starting point was I cut off one inch of it I weighed one inch it comes up to 21.6 grains so once I know the length of one inch and I know what my result that I'm looking for is, which is 45.9 grains. I can take a calculator and figure out the length that would give me 45.9 grains. And what I did was I cut it a little bit long so I could file it exactly to the correct weight. And I used my uh, chamfering tool to clean up the edges after I cut it. It's normal good chamfering tool. So now that I have my check weight made, I can put that on there, and that should give me 45.9. So now when my scale starts getting off, because they, they, they uh, will wander a little bit, the humidity will change, the uh, barometric pressure will change, any, anything that throws them off, even a wooden bench like this that uh, it changes its balance due to the humidity changing well, is going to uh, change it. So of course you need to get, keep, your, keep your scale balanced, and I've got my, my little level right there to check that and I've got shimmed underneath my scale to keep it in a good balance and I just should just change out shims whenever I need to and that's about it if, if you want to build yourself some check weights that's one way you can do it I'm sure that there's plenty of other ways but that's one way and like always good luck and good shooting